Hello and welcome to 305 East Dorothy Lane, Kettering, Ohio. Here we're out in the front of this home walking up the driveway to the front door. As you can see, we have a huge front porch here. So whether you're a back porch sitter or a front porch sitter, this home has a little bit of something for everyone, but a huge front porch to watch the world go by. Screen door, updated front door there as well. And guys, this has gorgeous brick on it. You see close up, this is recessed in here. Very nice corners on here. And it's full brick going around here as well. So with all of those tornadoes that just went through, it's nice knowing you have a brick home. And then we have a nice Florida room. This is the back porch sitting. Screened in porch on this one. Yard over here is completely fenced in. We have the gate right here. And a very nice, easily manageable backyard as well. Have a little burn pit back here in the corner. And guys, this is a massive garage here. Definitely a luxury in Kettering having a two car garage. And this one is pretty deep as well. So very nice garage. Next, let's go inside and take a look. All right, so here I just walked to the front door. Gorgeous hardwood floors flow throughout most of the first floor of this house. Windows, I think all but one of the windows have been updated. And a good sized living room obviously can accommodate a huge sectional or many other different types of furniture arrangements. Living room flows right into the dining room. I love the arches. There's one going into the kitchen as well. And we have a newer front door with a screen door, which we saw when we were on the front porch there. So walk in the dining room, area rug here, but this is hardwood in the dining room. You do have a closet right here. And this is the one window that has not been updated. The rest of them are double pane glass with uh, vinyl windows. And this is aluminum. It does have a storm window in it. Ooh, this is nice. Nest thermostat. Those are programmable and you can control them on your phone. Kitchen. Kitchen appliances all stay. This was updated several years ago. New ceramic tile and pretty much everything in here was new. Even have crown molding up on top. This window overlooks the backyard. Double bowl sink. And then the backyard that we've already looked at. And then this takes us down to the basement. And then we do have, I'm gonna go ahead and show this to you why we're here. A Florida room on the back of the home. This is all screened in. And it's actually really private back here. Have the air conditioner over there, but we'll, uh, we've already seen all of this when we looked at the garage and stuff. So let's go back inside and show you the other bedrooms. We do have a dishwasher. And then bedroom number one. This will be on the front right of the home if you're looking at it from the street. Good size bedroom, we have the hardwood in here. Windows are updated, updated ceiling fan in here as well. And very good size bedroom. And the closet is over here. And perfect spot to put the TV. Have our full bathroom right here. Before we go there, go into bedroom number two. We do have a closet right here. Currently being used as an office. This would be on the back right of the home. Update windows in here. We do have a ceiling fan. And again, I love these hardwood floors. They're a little wider slats than what you normally see. The bathroom here is a shower tub. And there's even tile on the ceiling in this bathroom. And that is our first floor here. And we do have a full partially finished basement. We're gonna go down there and take a look. That's where our third bedroom is located. And there's also a good entertaining area down there as well. So let's go downstairs and check it out. All right, so here it just came down to the basement. As you can see, this is partially finished down here. Great rec room, could easily throw a pool table in here, ping pong table, or have it be a theater room slash gamer room right here and really it's very very long we do have carpet and then definitely ohio state theme down here so hopefully you are a ohio state fan if not a little bit of paint can change that real quick 
Now, coming through here, we have our utility room and storage area and mechanical area. We have our gas furnace right there, gas water heater right here, and then obviously good amount of storage here, washer and dryer over here, glass block windows down here. And guys, this is a huge storage room over here. Runs the whole length from that wall all the way over there. So if you didn't want your stuff to be visible, easily hidden over there. And then a the big surprise down here, we have our third bedroom over here. And this room is completely finished. I see this is probably a queen, may, yeah, this is probably a queen size bed here. This is all completely finished. This little closet right here also hides our water meter. And then a massive closet in here. This is a huge amount of storage. This thing is probably three, four foot deep in and runs the whole length all the way here, all the way over there. And our Cutler Hammer upgraded panel box is in here as well. And then our closet over there. So huge bedroom to go along with the two bedrooms upstairs. Next, I'll meet you upstairs for a few closing statements. So thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions about this home or if you'd like to see it in person, feel free to give me a call or give your realtor a call. I'm sure they would be happy to show you this fine home as well. Partially finished basement, nicely updated, huge garage. Guys, this house has so much going for it. Close to the shops of Oakwood, great walkability on this home, all kinds of things that you can go do and just loaded with class and charm. Thanks for watching and I look forward to talking to you.